Hi, welcome to Clinic Sources Micro Training Videos. Today we're going to discuss how to create a new care plan. I'm going to go ahead and log into Clinic Source, and there's two kinds of care plans you can create: the initial care plan or a new care plan for a patient that already has a care plan in place. Let's talk about the initial care plan. In documentation, you'll see that I do have two patients on my left-hand side. My first patient's highlighted Steve, and you can see that I have an evaluation on the chart, but I have no care plan. So let's create the initial care plan. To do so, simply select the evaluation by putting a check mark to the right of the word evaluation. And at the top, the second button from the left in the icon tray allows you to create a new care plan. Once selected, the care plan will open up and you can go ahead and feel free to fill out the document as pertinent. When you scroll down, you do have the ability to define any modalities as well as any goals that you want to use in the course of treatment. The modalities slash interventions and goals do flow into your daily note for use and assignment. Once the care plan is complete, Simply select save at the top left hand corner of the blue disk or click the pen to sign. I'm going to go ahead and just click the blue disk and save. And you'll see that on my patient's chart, I have a care plan underneath my evaluation. So that is the initial care plan. Let's talk about a new care plan for a patient that already has one created. I have a test patient off to the left and on this patient's chart, you will see that I do have a evaluation and a care plan in place as well as additional treatment notes underneath the care plan. Let's just say now is May 31st as the example, and it's time to do a new care plan. Even though the original one that I wrote on March 1st, you can see has been signed off to the right hand side. To create a new care plan on this patient's chart, the easiest way to do so is to put a check mark next to the original care plan you created and up at the top in the icon tray, click the copy document button. When the document opens, you will see that I have the edit button at the top called edit template. Essentially, all I'm doing is editing the original document that I created and you can see that my plan of care date at the top has today's date of May 31st. If I scroll down, I can make any changes necessary. I can delete the goals I no longer need. And I can add additional goals if I so choose. Once my edits are complete, just save or sign the document above. I will just click save the blue disk in the upper left hand corner of the icon tray. You'll see on my patient's chart now, I have my evaluation, the original care plan, the treatment session notes down below. And then I have a new care plan dated 531. So anytime I see or treat the patient on or after 531, the new goals and interventions will automatically flow into my new or current notes. I hope you've enjoyed this short micro training video on creating a care plan. Thank you.